Santa's sleigh, a very important job as you know, and the next, or the next thing I know, I'm tangled up in these lights, and the rest of the reindeer, you know, Donna, Blitzen, Dancer, Dasher, Prancer, Vixen, Comet, oh, who have I forgotten? I think I've bumped my head. Can you remember? Ah, yes, that's right, Cupid. Well, they all had to leave because Santa has not finished delivering his presents yet, and as I'm sure you can imagine, there are a lot of presents to deliver tonight. Do you think you can help me find my way home? Can you? Oh, that would be great! Okay, no time to lose. Let's get going. To the North Pole! Everyone, are we getting nearer to the North Pole? <laughs> I think we are because it's getting colder, and I've just seen a snowman and some sleeping polar bears. I hope you've tiptoed past them really quietly so you didn't wake them up. Be careful on this icy floor, too. Okay, everyone, keep going. We must be getting nearer now.
How did you manage that? Oh my word! Should we have a photograph together? Mm -hmm. Right, let's have you three here. That's better. Oh, lovely! Right, let's have a little chat. Now, the important question I've got to ask is, what would you like for Christmas? You go first. I'll see what I can do. Now, have you written me a list yet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you sent it to the North Pole? Mm -hmm. yeah. Well, what happens is I get to read it, elves get to read it, and the grown ups get to read it as well. And it's the grown ups who make that final decision what we put under the tree. So, guess what? It'll be really nice to the grown ups all the way through to Christmas. Can you do that? Do you promise? Do you promise you promise? Do you promise you promise you promise? High five, promise. There you go. Can't bring a high five, promise. On Christmas Eve, could you leave me out something to eat and drink? Oh, something like a mince pie or biscuits, please. And a glass of milk. Oh, I don't know, I don't know. Um, and also, guys, do you know how many reindeer I've got? Uh, they do have eight or nine. Oh, you're very good. Should we go? There's Dasher and Dancer, Prancer and Vixen, Comet and Cupid, Donna and Blitzen. And there's one at the front with broken noses. His name is? Derry. I was going to say, Derry. Yeah, it's a screw dog, isn't it? He's the hungriest on the ball. He doesn't get his couch, here he does. Well, he's in the park. Yeah, he's in the park. He nibbles toes, grown ups' toes in particular. He does. So on Christmas morning, is it going to be breakfast first or presents first? Uh, breakfast. Presents. Do you know what I do? I like some presents first, then I have some breakfast, then I have some more presents, then I have second breakfast, then I have some more presents, then I have 11 seeds and more presents. And so, one last thing for you. I've got some little thank you gifts for coming along today. They're not proper presents, they're just a little thank you to say thank you very much for coming on. Got it? There we go. There we go. And that's for you. And now, this is the important thing. On Christmas Day itself, can you give everybody a big hug and tell them how much you love them? Because that's what Christmas is really all about. Letting people know they're loved on a special day. Will you do that for me? Do you promise? Can I have a fist bump from this time? Well, I hope you have an amazing Christmas. And thank you two for bringing such wonderful children here. So, my mouth will point you in the right direction and enjoy the park for the rest of the day. You take care, my lovelies, and have a very happy Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Thank you.